This video is an announcement of an ambitious new project which we have been working on behind the scenes for almost a year already. It is a little different to the projects we have shown you so far and much more ambitious. Whilst we will continue to carry out our repair and restoration workload, we have also begun to take our workshop much more in the direction of making watches. You may have seen the watches we previously sold under the Cerberus brand name, which were a successful first step into watch manufacturing and enabled us to fund the next step which we have been designing ever since. These contained brought-in movements and some other components purchased ready-made such as hands, which enabled us to make a start in the world of watchmaking, alongside our own manufactured parts. We have decided to ratchet up the level of our ambition, to match what we really love about horology, and move the brand in the way of a true independent watchmaking studio, producing unique watches of the very highest levels of quality. In order to set the tone of our work and ensure that we can reach the level required, we have begun to undertake a massive technical exercise, making a version of the horological masterpiece, George Daniels' Space Traveller One. This will be the work of several years and is only just beginning. We will be financing our work by carrying out our busy workload and there will be times that the restoration and repair side of the business has to take priority, but we will continue to make steady progress on this project. You can view more details on this channel and on our blog. The link is in the description to this video. I will upload any videos relating to this project to a new playlist so they can be located separately. Already, just in the first few stages of the project, we have been reminded just how great the horology and wider engineering communities are. We've had help from SolidWorks who have been great in helping us get licensed to use their amazing CAD software. We've had advice from established watchmakers and offers of mutual assistance from others who are at similar stages of their watchmaking journeys. Our jeweler neighbor helps us with plating and free use of a laser welder. Free permission to use some high quality images of Space Traveler has been allowed by SJX Watches. Please view their excellent article on Space Traveler, which I have linked in the description. We've had help from the brilliant Precision Manufacturing Center at Nottingham Trent University, who have helped us with some extremely accurate measurements and advice and of course a massive amount of help from Daniels himself via his book Watchmaking, which lays out a great amount of detail on the watch with the purpose of allowing future generations a fighting chance of making a version of it. We will also be adding a little of our own design changes to the project to increase the level of horological merit. So there we are. We will keep you updated with regular videos and a weekly blog on our site. If you would like to help us complete this project and help speed up the work, Please like this video, subscribe and share. This generates income which will be used to meet the enormous costs involved in such a project. You can also buy your watch straps through our site and even watches which we have restored. They all come with a one year warranty and are in great working order. This helps us to reinvest in the company and make this project a reality. You can use the code YouTube10 for a special discount on anything on our website store. Thanks again for watching and taking an interest in our workshop.